I've heard people who are world champions, like uh, for example Tyson Fury, the the boxer, he mm. talks about this. Like, there's this thing about like reaching the very top that, like, if your identity and what you identify with is the pursuit of improvement, right? Getting to that top actually might be a very depressing thing because you don't know what comes next. So mm. you are defending now. I'm no longer attacking, mm. which is what you have done actually like twice already, mm. right? Because it was what it was, was it the the first one was what Tokyo was what Beijing, Beijing yeah. right? Beijing. Then you defended it twice. Correct. So like, is do do you feel that thing the existential horror of what the I'm on the top now shit? The first time yes. The first time yes. The first time yes, and I was sixteen at that point in time. Oh, so I think huh. it, it it's given me a lot of uh, time to adapt to it, mm, mm. but not not in a bad way or anything. It's a uh, when I was sixteen, I I got to go, and then I came back. I was like, what's next? You know, yeah, like yeah, what's yeah, next? Yeah. I didn't necessarily think about defending my title or anything. It was mm. just like, okay, I'm here. Mm. It's the highest point. Then what now? Yeah, yeah, what now? Yeah, what now? What now? Do I get a lot of money now? <laughs> you know, am so, I done for life? <laughs> I didn't get a lot of money. Yeah. It was not done for life. <laughs> but the next couple of years were very strange because yeah. you spend that amount of time training for painting and then suddenly you're like, suddenly I'm free. Mm. What do I do now? Yeah. 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 I didn't Play know that. Play <laughs> Last time, no la. Last time I thought uh, gaming was... Uh... Evil vice that will suck up all your time, right? <laughs> you know, recently we had a post about the boxers, man. I feel like that ties where... I was going to... Yes. Good. Cause yeah. like this one Beijing is the different. next thing, yeah. right? Yeah. I mean, so you break that box, yeah. right? Yeah. Yeah. Hey, I'm here now. What oh, is another yeah. one day? Because yeah. we probably experience it on a, re- on a a lot smaller level. Mm. Like last yeah. time, I used to think when I was 16, I remember like O levels would be in the yes, the end exactly. of like end the yeah. season finale of my life. Yeah. You know, everything yeah. would be good. it'll be okay after this. Yeah, <laughs> it was true, not true. okay yeah. after this. Yeah, exactly. So like, it's really like you need to learn how to enjoy the moment instead of keep looking yes, for something yes, to. Yes. Because they keep looking for something helps you to get better a lot of the times. Mm. But like what you might end up happening like exactly what is it that you forget that I'm going through a lot of awesome shit mm. right now mm. and this won't last forever. Mm. So I better enjoy this now also, right? Yeah. So how did you deal with that then? Um, okay, so 16 then, yeah. uh, I thought to myself, okay, I did pretty badly in my O-levels. Yeah. I mean, it's a box that I got out of the box, but I was... How about you go, go, like, go, man, I this. punched one small hole in the box, kind oh, yes. of opening the whole thing. <laughs> right, 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 right. <laughs> yeah. So I thought to myself, if I can be Paralympic champion, if yeah. I can get gold medals, come on, I can study. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. So mm. I put in a lot of effort into my studies uh, in RP. Oh. I studied sports science, which I oh, liked. Oh, oh. And uh, I had so many tutors, because like, before that, I had a sports science team. Yeah. And they would help me uh, in school and everything. Cheat code. Code, right? <laughs> then, uh, but also I quite smart. No, and you also <laughs> no. The, you you like the thing. True, I like yeah, the thing. You're interested, Correct. and it's relevant to what you're doing exactly. at that moment. Right? That's what I felt also because I never did my homework when I was in mm. school, and then like when I got to poly, it was something that I liked for the first time, mm. and the teachers didn't have to nag me to do homework. I just did it because yes. I like the thing. Mm. So sometimes that's the difference, mm. uh, You know. Mm. Yeah. So, um, then that whole year, right, it was a bit washed out for me in training, like. I, I keep saying that I was uh, focusing on school, spending time in school, but yeah. at the same time, I was spending time being a teenager. Oh, you know, before okay, that, okay. I didn't have late nights. Yep. I didn't hang out with my friends. Yep. I didn't hang out with my friends so much that they stopped wanting to become my friends. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Because always, I can't make it. Yeah, yeah I gotta go sleep. training, yeah. yeah. And then, uh, I started like doing teenager stuff. Yeah, right? yeah. So it got really hard to stop. And go back to the momentum. Huh. Eventually, when I went back, right, it was a <coughs> bit too <coughs> late. Um, that's why I didn't do that well in London. Mm. But also, like, lesson learned. I was actually really afraid after London. It was more like a... Beijing was so long ago. I was young. Like a wake-up call. Was My body could do it. I am huh. now... By the time I go to Rio, I'll be 24. I used to be yeah. able to do this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So my first session with my psychologist, when I told her... When I said it out loud, yeah, 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 cause, yeah. cause wanting something and saying it out loud is very different. Yes. So when I said it out loud, I want to go medal in real. Then I started crying. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I can imagine that. Yeah, because saying it means like I, I somebody it else is hearing yeah. it. Yeah, it suddenly makes it another level of 